What is up, FTS Nation Football Galaxy here with an all new video here in FTS 15. And for today, guys, we got another international friendly as the U.S. will be playing against Uruguay. It's going to be a tough game. I am expecting the U.S. to actually lose because, come on, they lost to Mexico 3-0. Like, come on, guys. How bad can you guys be? The U.S. showed us how bad they can be. So I'm expecting Uruguay to destroy them with at least like a 3-0 <laughs> win, to be honest, because that's how bad the U.S. is. But in this FTS match, there's only one way to predict who could win, and it's by playing a game here between the U.S. and Uruguay. So let's go, boys. USA in the red kit. Uruguay in the regular sky blue kit. I want to call it that, I guess. So we got Suarez and Cavani. Obviously, I'm ex I am expecting them to score most of the goals. And here we go, boys. Game underway. USA and Uruguay. Let's go. Here comes Jones. To Dempsey, USA on the attack, wanting to score the goal, but Uruguay takes the ball back. Forlan, nope, intercepted, back to the U.S., Altador. Gonna go for Bradley, can he go for Bradley? No, he cannot go for Bradley. And that's gonna go out, I think. That's gonna go out, that's gonna go out, and yes, it will go out. Throw in for the United States. Here comes the throw in. It's gonna go for Bedoya. Nice pass to Altador, oh, never mind. Dempsey makes a nice interception. He's going to go for Graham Zuzzi for the shot. Dempsey for the rebound. And there it is, boys. Clint Dempsey puts the first goal for the United States. It's 1-0. And that was a pretty good rebound shot by Dempsey. Graham Zuzzi, he made a nice shot towards goal. But what a save from the goalkeeper. we got to see that again in slow motion. That was a great save. Unfortunately for the goalkeeper, the ball goes right to the feet of Clint Dempsey. Goal wide open, and Clint Dempsey just simply has to take the opportunity, the advantage, and scores the first goal. And here we go, boys. Game back underway. Uruguay down by one. USA having a great lead. Of course, I hardly doubt this will happen in real life, but when it comes to soccer, soccer is unpredictable. So you never know. Here comes Caceres. I have no idea where the key is. Altador, nice interception. And uh, I have no idea who the heck these guys are. Godin, hey, it's Godin. I know who he is. Ball back for the U.S. Gonzalez to Altador, but Altador was offside. Oh, was Altador offside? I guess he is again. Okay, I guess he was offside. I don't know. I guess he was. I don't know. I still need to learn the offside rule. Uh, I guess here we go. Altador, what am we doing? Throw in for the U.S. We're uh, getting close to scoring that second goal, but Uruguay has been doing pretty decent in defending the goal, not letting us score a second goal, which, to be honest, I'm not surprised because... We should be losing this game. I am surprised Uruguay hasn't had a, sh a shot towards goal yet so far. Goudin with the ball. Nice interception back to, to Dempsey. We could do something. Dempsey. Now it's a foul on Dempsey. Oh, come on, bro. Goudin. Altor trying to get that ball back. Can he do it? Yes, he can. Nice shot, but uh, he wasn't passing it to anyone, of course. Dempsey, he couldn't get the ball. First half yet to end. Nice interception. USA looking for the second. Could this be it? Here comes the ball to Dempsey. Dempsey for the second. There it is. Clint Dempsey. Second goal for the US. Second goal tonight for him in the game. 2-0. Pretty good goal by Clint Dempsey. Pretty decent. Nice pass, I also have to admit. From uh, who was that guy again? It was... Uh, Be is that Beasley? Yeah, it's Beasley. Beasler, nice pass, nice assist. Dempsey takes the opportunity and scores the goal. Let's go, boys. One minute of extra time left for the first half, and <laughs> no minute of extra time left for the first half. All right, let's go to the substitutions. Let's see who we can replace. Fabian, uh, no, that's not Fabian Johnson. Johansson. Uh, maybe we could replace. Oh yes. Definitely replace Fabian Johnson with Beasler. 
Um, I'm going to replace Howard with Guzan. Just so we can get a better defense. And I think that's going to be it. I'll probably be doing some uh, striker substitution. Probably towards the end of the game. So here we go boys. Second half underway. USA leading 2-0. I'm surprised that Suarez and Cavani literally have not had the ball throughout this entire time. It's kind of funny. Zuzi with the ball. Never mind. Caceres or whatever. Altador, nice play. Going to go for Bedoya. Bedoya going to go for Altador again. Altador takes the ball from Goudin. Altador for the third. And there it is. Josie Altador puts the third goal for the U.S. Of course, this is a game. This is fiction. Not going to happen in real life. At least that's what I think. But a good goal by Clint Dempsey. What the crap was the goalkeeper doing? I have to skip this. What the heck was the goalkeeper doing? What? Bro, goalkeeper, come on, man. So Cavani and Suarez... Uh, never mind, Suarez just wasted the ball. That was the only time he ever had the ball in this game. Forlan... Bradley couldn't get the ball. Now he could. Um, that was a really bad pass, bro. Nice interception by Omar Gonzalez. Going to go for Altidore. Nice save. Bradley for the rebound over the bar. And what do you expect from Bradley, to be honest, you know? He's bad in the game. He's bad in real life. That thing is not... Unpredictable. Dempsey. He couldn't get the ball. No, he can't. Nice pass to Altador. Gonna go for Bradley. Gonna go for Bradley. Yes, it can. You know, Bradley just good in making passes. and being through. If he try There's no point in him trying to score a goal. Because every time that he does, he always screws it up. And apparently, Bedoya was offside. I don't know how. Alright guys, Altidore trying to get that ball, he can't, Dempsey takes the ball back though, from Goudin, Goudin is doing horrible defending, and why the heck would Goudin kick the ball over? Uh, I think it's time for a substitution, it's the 74th minute so I think we can do this, Altidore replacing him with, uh, let's do with Dempsey, then Altidore replacing with, uh, I'm going to do... I'm gonna do actually that. I'm gonna do replace. I'm gonna do a four, four, two, three, one, B formation, change formation. Uh, I'm gonna put Altador as the second striker. So there's Altador. Bradley's right there. Jones is right there. Bedoya and Zuzi. And Jones is right there. Okay. I'm gonna replace Green with Jones. And that will be the final substitution for the U.S. for today. And here we go, boys. Throw in. It's going to go for Suarez, who actually mir miraculously has the ball until now. Altidore. Altidore still with the ball. Going to go for Green with a nice shot just wide. Pretty close by Green there. And substitution for Uruguay. I believe that's the first substitution for the game. Too late for them because like it's less than, it's less than 10 minutes. They've hardly had a single shot towards goal. And we've just had way more possession than they have. Goalkeeper kicks it. Perez with the ball now. Bedoy trying to in get the ball back. He can. Okay, nope. But it will be a throw in. Here comes Beasley. And what the heck was that? Cavani. Oh, oh, this could be the first goal here for Uruguay. Unless if Omar Gonzalez is there to intercept the ball first. Bedoya, nice pass to Altador. Altador running with the ball. Altador looking for the fourth. Altador, go back, bro. Gonna go for Den Dempsey. No, nope. okay. Referee to blow the whistle. Rodriguez with the ball. Zuzi gonna go after it. And there it is. Full time as the U.S. defeat Uruguay. 3 0. Pretty good. Um, I mean, it was horrible by Uruguay. But pretty good for the U.S. Of course, I doubt this will actually happen in real life. I think the roles will be reversed in real life, but then again, football is unpredictable, so you never know what's going to happen. Apparently, we had 52% possession of the ball. I mean, they had 52 possession. We had 48%. I totally disagree with that, but whatever. 
And apparently they had 86% completion, pass completion. We had 64%. Wow. Okay, sure. Well, guys, that is it. That is our prediction for the USA and Uruguay international match. Hopefully you guys can watch it. Don't miss it. Don't miss USA losing to Uruguay. Because I'm pretty sure they're going to lose. Um, and yes, that is it for this video. Thank you so much guys for watching. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and share. Stay tuned for more videos on the Football Galaxy channel. And until then, have yourselves a great Galaxy night.